This is a promotional video for our work titled Causal Question Answering with Reinforcement Learning. My name is Stefan Heinloff and I'm from Paderborn University. What I present is joint work with Lukas Blübaum. Causal questions ask about relationships between causes and effects. For example, does pneumonia cause anemia? In this work, we particularly focus on binary causal questions, which can be answered with yes or no. Causal questions occur in many use cases. For example, it has been found that about 5% of questions submitted to search engines are causal. Moreover, causal questions are frequently asked to virtual assistants like Amazon Alexa and in automated decision making. Previous approaches to causal question answering are mainly based on large language models, which are not explainable and whose answers are not verifiable. In contrast, in this work, we answer causal questions with a causality graph. On the right, you can see an example. Such a causality graph nodes are known phrases and edges are causal relations. Additional provenance data for causal relations is available. To answer a binary causal question, causes and effects from the question are linked to nodes in the graph. Then a path from the source to the target node is searched, for example via breast-first search. However, in large causality graph, this is inefficient and requires many nodes to be visited. Instead, in this work, we perform the graph traversal using reinforcement learning. First, nodes and edges are embedded into an embedding space via the noun phrases and provenance data. Then, walks in the graph are performed through a reinforcement learning agent. At each node, the agent selects a neighboring node that likely leads to the target node. Once a path is found, this path can explain the mechanism by which the cause causes the effect. Answers are verifiable because for each edge, provenance data can be retrieved that states the source of the edge. In our experiments, we were able to show that the search space can be pruned by 99% compared to a breath-first search. To summarize our contributions, first, we answer binary causal questions with reinforcement learning. Second, we introduce a supervised bootstrapping procedure to deal with the problem of large action spaces and sparse rewards. Third, we construct a new causal question answering dataset. In our paper, you can find many more details, for example, on the causality graph, on our reinforcement learning agent and evaluation results.